so sailboat racing is, is a lot like NASCAR in the fact that we have a certain number of laps that we have to go around the race course. Uh, we use fixed buoys in the water. Um, and everybody starts between an imaginary line in the water between uh, the, the signal boat, which is what I'm stationed on, and a, uh, a buoy in the course. So we do a time sequence, and at the zero gun, everybody is on the line and going at the same time. Um, they race around the buoys a number of laps, whether it's two laps or three laps or, or however it is, and then they come back through that imaginary line to finish. And then the first place boat gets one point, the second place boat gets two, and so on. So the cumulative score at the end of the event, the, the object is to get the lowest number of points uh, by the end, of the end of the event. And after 10 races, they'll crown a national champion. Great to have the nationals here, uh, just because it's hosted everywhere else and it's our first nationals. We're the largest fleet and uh, it's kind of neat to defend it on your home turf. I mean, the odds would be that I'd be in St. Petersburg sailing against six national champions from St. Petersburg. Um, the neat thing is that We've doubled the size of last year's fleet. There were like 20 boats last year, and now we've got roughly 40. And six of the competitors are national champions, and they're good sailors. Nice that we have breeze right now. That was the big fear, is that you come from the ocean where there's a sea breeze that you can depend on. And if there's no breeze here, it could be difficult. And, uh, but that actually makes it more fun if the wind is spotty, like it should be here at Hoover. It might give the guys from the ocean a tough time because they're so used to being sailing in a straight line where we maneuver. So it should be a lot of fun and it'll, it'll be tough. I've been sailing here since um, probably 1963. And uh, I guess I'm the longest. And you're the longest tenured member here? Tenured member in the club. Um, I used to sail lightnings. I sailed those for about five years, and then after we got married, uh, we decided to get a two-person boat, and the windmill just fit our needs. We're up against some really good sailors in this fleet, uh, in this fleet and also uh, in the class. And we're going to be sailing against four or five national champs, and uh, one of whom is a sailmaker, and so he always does well. He sails lots of different classes, so um, it, it will be real challenging. and. Uh, We'll try to do what we can.